and welcome to my channel. My name is Venetia Alexander Marshall and welcome. If you're new here, hi, how are you? Don't forget, hit the subscribe button at the bottom and make sure you click on the notification bell so every time I am uploading a new video, you are notified. We are here for part three, the last one. Um, I've already done the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. I've already done the Elf Halo Glow Liquid Filter. Now today, this is part three, part three, part three. Now, all of a sudden, Fenty Beauty decided they wanted to release a little something, something too. So I did pick up, it's still in the box. This is the new Fenty Beauty. This is their all over glow enhancer. Here it is. As you can see, I still have it in the box. Um, the shade, I do believe, number three, uh, Honey Citrine is what I have. That's the shade I have, number three. Um, so again, just like before, like the other two, I am going to do a wear test for you guys just to see how this product is. Um, I believe this retails for $34. So it's a little cheaper than the Charlotte Tilbury, but still up there in the high-end range and more expensive than the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead. We're going to put this to the test today. And most of the products um, will be mostly Fenty. I will put all the products that I am wearing in the bottom of the description box. So let's go ahead and let's get started with this makeup look featuring the new Fenty Beauty All Over Glow Enhancer. Don't prove me wrong, prove you right. Don't prove me wrong, prove you right. My word is but we don't spit no lies. A daughter of the sunshine. So this is my finished look featuring the new Fenty Beauty Halo Enhancer. This is Halo Enhancer. This is their Glow Enhancer. I don't know why I can't talk, but yeah, this is the new Fenty Beauty Glow Enhancer that is supposed to act like an uh, enhancer just like the Charlotte Tilbury and just like the Elf. So again, we're going to put this to the test and I'm just going to go ahead and say right now, I kind of like this. I kind of like how this turned out i kind of do with this underneath my makeup so again i'm going to check in at the halfway mark and i'm going to do a final check-in and give you my final results once i come back home right now we are running a little late we getting ready to run out of here my daughter running late <laughs> So I am going to check in with you guys probably around my lunchtime and give you a full look at what my face looks like during the halfway point. So I will check back with you guys later. Here is the halfway mark. A little shiny. But I like it. I 
business is my dog closet door is open. Yeah. Which I think so far is so good. Got a little shine in my regular areas. But for the most part, yeah, in here my nose, I got indentions in my glasses. But for the most part, yeah, lipstick gone. It's a lip gloss on. But for the most part, it's holding up pretty good. I'm gonna do my final check in when I get home from work. All right, guys, I am back. I have worn this makeup for again for nearly 12 hours. Um, it is after seven o'clock, so I am gonna give you my final thoughts. The um, Glow Enhancer uh, from Fenty Beauty, so I'm gonna give you guys my final thoughts. Um, I am now looking at my face after nearly 12 hours of wear. Some of my oils in my regular area, which is here in my nose, basically in my T-zone area, um, the, sh the oils have um, popped through. They've popped through a little bit sooner than I thought. Um, but yeah, for me personally, I don't have any catching or anything, but I do have a healthy amount of oil on my face. Um, so yeah, I will say this product is not bad. I will say it lasted a little bit longer than the... Charlotte Tilbury lasted a little bit longer, um, but not as long as the e.l.f. Halo Glow. Um, so if I had to choose between the three, number one would probably be um, the Charlotte Tilbury. I mean, I mean, we got to keep it real. The Charlotte Tilbury is a great product. It did last a long time. I would say this from Fenty Beauty would be a very close second and then the e.l.f. Halo Glow. I know I'm going to make some people mad when I made e.l.f. the last one that I would pick. Um, I know a lot of people really do like that product from e.l.f., but I don't know. I would go in between the Charlotte Tilbury and the Fenty Beauty. Now, I know some people did not like this the Fenty Beauty um, Enhanced Glow. And it's probably why I didn't get a lot of people talking about it. Um, because it's mainly about Charlotte Tilbury and e.l.f. But for me, I would go probably in between the Charlotte Tilbury and the Fenty. Um, but if you're looking for something a little more affordable, then yes, then go with the e.l.f. Go with the e.l.f. Halo Glow. This is, for me, a pretty good product. I mean, I would... I would wear it underneath makeup. Um, so yeah, that is it with this video. So I want to thank you guys that have been tuned into my channel and watching my channel. I know I've gotten some new people to my channel. So thank you so much for watching. So with that being said, this is Felicia Alexander Marshall. I hope you have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.